We're back, fellow knife enthusiasts. I'm C with Atlantic Knife, and today we'll be discussing the Roik 127B. We don't do a lot of uh, Roik reviews, but this one I wanted to cover because it's a very popular style that a lot of companies uh, carry and seem to have. Uh, I, I really like this one, so I wanted to show it to everyone. All right, we'll start off by showing you the knife. It comes in this standard Roik box. Get you a close up here. We'll tell you that this knife is 8.63 inch overall. Has a 3.75 inch Tanto blade with a Sandvik 14C28N steel satin finish. It is a manual flipper, G10 handle, has uh, a lanyard hole. Also, it has a glass break, but you don't see really a lot of that on uh, standard pocket knives nowadays. That was something done a few years ago, but can always be helpful. Tip up right hand or left hand carry. So your pocket clip's reversible. Has a mostly see-through chassis with a black G10 backspacer here at the bottom of the frame. The stainless steel liner has been milled to cut down on the weight which comes in at a little bit over four ounces. The G10 scales have this design in them to help you uh, keep your grip as you're holding the knife. It also has a feature that I like, which I, I like jimping, but this has a little bump at the top of the knife to keep your thumb, as you can see, from sliding as you cut down and the flipper tab comes in at the bottom to keep your finger from going forward. Since it is a liner lock, as you can see here, it is uh, easy for one hand carry, has a locking system so you can't force the liner closed unless you unlock it. Very smooth opening knife. Try to get my hand around here so you can see it. All right, let's go ahead and show you how this knife performs. Bring some paracord over. I'm sure it's going to be extremely sharp as I expected. A little bit of fraying there. Let's give it another shot, especially up here on the tanto end. That's very sharp. Bring a box over to show you how this knife, uh, I'm big on the fingerprints, so I always keep my cleaning cloth handy. tell the point is very sharp. I'm trying not to press too hard that way we don't cut through to the uh, board which we've done about a million times. So this knife is a uh, Be a nice little everyday carry. We have some more stuff on the, uh, must have been some tape on that box. I always get that glue from the tape on there. There we go. Didn't get it all, but I'll have to live with it. So once again, this is the Roik P127B. It's a nice little uh, folder. They could be a nice addition to your 
collection or a great everyday carry for a uh, person that's looking for a thin handled pocket knife. If you're watching us on Instagram, make sure you follow Atlantic Knife. We do tons of reviews and knife content as well as giveaways. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Watch our weekly show. We do giveaways there. And also post these five minute reviews. On that note, Roik P127B, IMC with Atlantic Knife, signing off.